guys. Okay. One, two, three. This, This is Masawa. Munga de Masawa. Zabakunda. We walked in, and that family back there, they offered us to eat with them. It's customary. Everyone will be there. All strangers will say, join us, eat with us. Yeah. Because village proceeds and takes precedence over individuality. <laughs> It looks like a Riyadh in America. Isn't that gorgeous? Gorgeous. Did you say Canada? Canada. <laughs> Good morning. It's uh morning time. Yep. I don't know where it is where you are. I don't know how it feels where you are, but where we are, it's hot as a mub. It's hot. It's like nine o'clock. And look at our view. We wake up. This is the view. Go ahead to the. Well, first we're gonna find something to eat, and then we're gonna head over to the beach. Um, I think we're like 20, 30 minutes from the beach. Should be like 10 or 20, not far to get there in a taxi. And um, yeah, we're gonna enjoy these last couple of days here before we head back. And I'm ready to tackle this fish. I heard so much about the fish in Masawa. Uh, they said it's the best. They prepared the best and it's the best. So we will let you see what's going on. Alkali Yogi is just not, she's not in. <laughs> she's just not herself today. Um, I'll let her elaborate if she wants to. She's just, uh, I don't know. I don't know. All right. <laughs> oh, you want to say something to the people? She's sleepy, that's what. She didn't get much sleep last night. And it wasn't because we were honeymooning <laughs> Yeah, it wasn't about the honeymooning. It was uh, just a restless fun. thing. Hmm? Noisy sound. Yeah, it was kind of noisy in the room. Um, hopefully we could we can get some sleep on the beach today. And uh, I'm sure we will. All right, we are out. We will see you in a second.
Joan's first day, first time ever in Masala. What's your baby here? Yeah, I can't wait to see the beach. We have the beach house. <laughs> Somewhat. First time back. A long time, man. Long time. Hope to get some energy. I don't need to walk in. Didn't sleep at all. So I kind of feel like I've been hit by a bus this morning. Hard to forgive my turn down nature. <laughs> Hoping some vitamin D and some sesame will give me some fuel for today. Okay, Jones. Jones is throwing tigrinya at me. Karai. So, bo. Come may have dirkum. Fahando? Fahando? Adirkum? Stay give it. <laughs> I know he's gonna become fluent more than quicker than me because I'll just wait till you get back. <laughs> he's going ham. Yeah, Jones is good at picking up new languages. When he takes an interest in something, he definitely um, goes full throttle and masters it. And then he'll teach me to get <laughs> <laughs> He'll be conversing with the family fluently. He'll be translating for me. <laughs> what is that you're trying to say? Yeah, exactly. I look forward to that day. We're on the hunt to find a cab to go to central Masawa, i.e. Gurgusum, Dahalak, Hamasian. Places um, that I normally stay at when I'm at the when I'm at the beach. All of those places have great restaurants. Central also has a great restaurant. Central is a hotel. Hold on, I have to say it how we say it here in Eritrea. Central. Central betami toam. Megbi betami toam. Very peaceful. What's today? Tuesday. Mm -hmm. Going up on a Tuesday. On our mini moon. We've got today and tomorrow regarding day six. That was the day of our wedding. Our surprise. We had nothing to do with it as far as organizing kind of wedding. <laughs> wedding day rather. Oh, it is more comfortable outside than it is inside, I will say. There's a bar right here. Oh yeah, perfect. We can have coffee, tea. I want to see if they do a different version of tea here. Maybe more of like a Swahili tea, I wonder. I'm going to ask. This is convenient to have next to us though. Yeah. I'm sure they sell food too. Yeah, the restaurant bar. It's a full restaurant bar. <sighs> we just got to remember what building number we are. Oh yeah. Well, right. this this will be a good landmark for us. What's the name of this spot? Um, it's in Tigrinya. <laughs> so that's the spot. <laughs> okay. Do you want to take a photo of it? Yeah, just we can take. We can show our cab drivers. When we come back. I think the English version is the one that fell off. We've got the Tigrinya, the Arabic, maybe the English version was on the side that's now fallen off. Yeah. Oh, there's a there's a bank right here, babe. Right in front of us. Bank right here, right in front of us. Yeah. But let's just see what prices are like before we do any more exchanges. Taxi? Taxi, Allo? For a taxi? Maybe 
we could take the bus. I wonder if the buses take us. Looks like this might be a bus depot of sorts, no? I'm easy. I just want to get to the to the um, to the hotel trains. To be honest, I don't mind taking a bus or a car. Looks like a bus stop. Yeah, over here, right? I was thinking. Okay. Oh, yeah. So we need to fetch some sustenance. That includes water, juices, as well as fruit. And if I can also nab myself some eggs, an omelet, I would like that very much now. Okay. So it was actually 
This is the palace, honey, that I was telling you about of Haile Selassie. Right behind Where? you. See, but it's already. Look at how oh, what bad mouth. shape it is. This was actually like seven and a half. Our fare for the two of us? Oh, this was only, he gave me uh, four back. This was six. Why was a guy trying to charge us 200? Maybe he made private a Private taxi. Me. No, he was, I think he was going to take us in private car. Oh. So I just hope we can grab a bus back from here. Oh, Maybe yeah. today we just hang out here at the Halak. Yeah. This is where my uncle that you met at the wedding used to cook okay. for many years. Yeah, good bad. Okay. This is one of the uh, <coughs> this is one of the most famous restaurant uh, restaurant hotels in Us in Masawa. Makta and I shared a room here. In this hotel? Yeah, and good. I've stayed at Gurgusum by myself on the beach. Uh, I stayed a couple of these you places. Stayed by yourself for hours here? Yeah, I went there by myself. I just needed a break you from Asmara. I don't know. I came down for three or four days, solo date. And stayed right on the beach. You right on doing, the beach. You're doing too much. I don't know. Well, you were taking a long time. I need to show up in my life. <laughs> so, where are we going to eat? Everything. Buffet. <laughs> I'm saying buffet. Eggs, fruit, juice. Coffee and tea. Manga de Masawa, the Balkan Maya, Manga de Masawa, the Balkan Maya, the good reader, Kurkawasa Maya. Another blonde lot, dreaded person. I thought I was the only one in the country, now he stole my shine. I'll share it with you, sir. No worries. I'll share it. And you know what? I bet you it's the son that did that to his life. Yeah, my hair would turn a good all bun brown, right. reddish brown. This sun is ain't no joke. I know. I got um like okay, I'm gonna go dark home. caramel right now. I'm gonna let you know I'm going ham. I'm getting eggs. I'm getting, you're getting full, so I can try that. <laughs> getting okay. fresh OJ and and uh, either a tea if they have something special that's like Swahili influence or Arabic influence. Otherwise, I'll get a coffee. How about yourself, sir? What do you have? Um, a smart beer. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> the mineral water is more than the beer. Mm, that's sparkling water. Well, first I need water. Yeah, amen. Let's both do a big one. Oh, let me get a fish sandwich. They have fish sandwiches? Oh, man. Yeah, you get that, actually. Fish sandwich. Yeah, you get that. Okay, no food. I'll get the eggs. You get the fish sandwich. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, is there any fruit available? No fruit? Okay. I'll just get the OJ then. You getting a coffee? Okay, we'll get we'll get a big natural water. Hello. Oh wah wah. Big old crows. Huge. So the family behind us just asked us if we want to join them on a trip to the islands. First they asked if we want to eat with them. It's just that's just the African way. We don't advocate for this. Yeah, we're not using that. Lale, 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 Lale. Much needed.
needed, much needed this morning. That was a long drive. You need good time, babe. It was only two and a half hours. Yeah, I knew it would be a little faster with the car. Yeah. And he would have made it even faster if you didn't down. tell him to slow down. <laughs> it felt dangerous to me, okay? Yeah, we it know. It felt really, really dangerous to me. We know I'm why. really surprised you didn't feel he was going too fast. Nah, I didn't feel like it. So fam, we were on our way down here yesterday. We ended up taking a taxi. We'll go more into that later. But um, he was doing like 70. And I it's, it's all downhill, like mountains. I don't like, watch. It's out of rail. That's why I didn't watch his thing. His mileage. Yeah. yeah I, I was could like, see it from where drive. I was. But was that 70 key? <laughs> see? I'm not sure if it was miles. He could only or, been going like kilometers. 35. <laughs> no, he wasn't going 35. I mean, we were, we were doing this at every corner, which was quite frequent because it's yeah. just going downhill the entire time. But I'm like, I know he does this trip like all the time. You could so tell he's like, definitely, yeah. yeah, he's a, he's, you could tell he's done this ride many, many times. He was definitely not a novice. Jones over here says he wants to do it next time. I don't know I'm doing why. It next time. If you caught the footage, I don't know why you would want <laughs> to drive down this road. I'm going to drive next time. That's done. Slow, right? Put, put. 25 miles mm -hmm. an hour? That's no, I gotta, I gotta go camera, with the right? flow of traffic. No, no, no. We agreed it's 25 miles an hour? No, everybody, I gotta be with the flow of traffic or else I'm gonna get, you know, we're gonna get in the accident. So, I'm gonna, if everybody's going fast, no. Nah, we're gonna be careful. Safety first, everyone. You know, Coco's gonna tell you to slow down, don't you reckon? Yeah, you will probably say, Pop, don't you think you're going a little fast? <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, it's a scary winding road I'm not going to lie guys but I appreciate a lot of these guys have loads of experience on this road um, and we were fortunate enough that uh, Beanie even know where to take us once we got into Masawa because it was a part of um, Masawa that I've not been to our accommodations I'm not familiar with that particular in Dakaria yeah I, I think yeah he knows he knows people yeah, here yeah he was he waving at people well. yeah I wonder if he ended up staying here last night I was meaning to actually ring them or ring our original cab driver Jonas, his brother, mm -hmm. to find out whether BD made it back last night. I'll check. Out, I'll follow yeah, up to make he sure. He checked on us, didn't he? His brother. Yeah, he, he checked on us to make sure that we got here safely. I was just a little bit. I was having a bit of a moment last night, guys. I have to be honest. It's nothing that I'm proud of, but like I was, I definitely got into. It's been a minute, so coming back to Earth now, having um, you know gotten over my diva moment. I'm sorry for leaving you hanging. Sorry for not coming back on the camera with you all last night. Um, now she's feeling somewhat better and more grounded. <laughs> <laughs> La <laughs> Okay, guys, I just stumbled upon something really beautiful and I want to get Jones's impression. Oh, wow. Whoa. Hello, Marrakesh. Wow. Hello, Saudi Arabia. Saudi Hello. I don't know what other beautiful Islamic country is out there. It looks like a Riyadh in Marrakesh. Isn't that gorgeous? So romantic with the archway. <laughs> So 
so we are just at the place next to Dahalak. I don't think this place is part of Dahalak. Um, it's really beautiful. As you can see, there's the Red Sea behind us. And we're just kind of walking on the periphery of this building minute. here. That's the Red Sea? Yeah. Oh, what okay. did you think it was? That's so cute. <laughs> we're walking around the periphery of this building that's adjacent to Dahalak, but I don't think it's part of Dahalak. Um, and I have to be honest with you all, my phone is heating up because it's hot here. It's really nice. It's comfortable because in the summer it easily gets to over 100, even 110 easily Fahrenheit uh, and centigrade. That's like easily between 38 and 42 degrees easily. I know because I've been here in the summertime, <laughs> um, but this is actually really nice and comfortable. Look at this. I don't know what this building is. Like I said, it's adjacent to Dahalak, but I don't know what it is. And right behind me, we have the Sports Commission, Northern Red Sea region. So maybe if one of you knows this area well, you can put it in the comment box what this building is, because I've not seen a name yet. Not been able to discern the name of this hotel, but it looks like a hotel because I've seen some rooms now. I saw some bedrooms. My gosh, it's like being back in Marrakesh, honestly. Look at that. Really gorgeous. Really, really gorgeous. And there's again the Red Sea right over my shoulder. See that? Gorgeous. So, um, yeah, we're taking a leisurely day here. You know, we've had a really, really busy day yesterday. So we sat, we sat a good two, two and a half hours at the Halak to enjoy our brekkie. Um, and we're just now getting up and going for a walk. We're going to walk through town with Jones and then I think the plan is to end up in Gurgusum, which is another hotel that's on the beach um, where we might just like rent some lounge chairs and towels and just hang out at the beach there and maybe have like a late lunch, early evening, sorry, a late lunch and an early dinner. Um, and we won't be out late because yeah, we've come out to just get some sun, take a dip in the water, get some grub. And then we will go and rest, retire, back at the flat. Jones is up to something. Stand by. All right, we have an announcement. Oh no, we don't do it He has his director slash producer hat on. He always does. Oh, here we are, right next to the pool again, where we all where it all began. There's that little bridge that we just walked over that kind of connects these two spaces. So it might be that these are two hotels, this hotel and then the Halak, which share this pool. I don't actually even remember this hotel being here. Yeah, Grand Hotel the Halak, and then whatever this gem is, and then the pool, which would be like an infinity pool if it was in use right now. So it'd be kind of cool with the Red Sea behind it. You get me, yeah? So it was nice having a really leisurely morning after a sleepless night and a long day seven um, to be able to just sit at the Halak and enjoy a nice brekkie and then just chat. The mister and I had a really nice long chat. It was just great. Just chilling, feeling leisurely. This is after all our mini moon. <laughs> we didn't know it when we planned it that it was going to be our mini moon because we didn't know we were having a wedding out here but since we had a wedding I mean you know after a wedding people go on a mini moon so even though we had this planned already now it's become our mini moon mini honeymoon he's looking for something he's on the oh. <laughs> you ready?
feet on camera. Put your feet on camera. <laughs> Oh yeah, the blue one? Yeah. The blue thing. You can see wow. all the color spectrum on there. Well, huh?
restaurants that serve out here. So when you come back here at night, because we've eaten out here actually, we've had good dinners out here. Really? Yeah, all this, all this, uh, all these restaurants that are behind you will serve out here at night time. Oh. Yeah, it gets, they put lights out and it's the whole thing. Because everything is more comfortable outside. Um, yeah, especially night, at night time, yeah. Because it was still hot. Yeah. When we got out the car, I was like, man, it's like the middle of summer hot. Oh, I started feeling it in the car when we were coming Oh, when we was on the mountains, yeah. Yeah, you start to feel the temperature. And, and that is all to say that this is the coldest month of the year. <laughs> no such thing as cold. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this was his off, or this was his as well, both of these. Benefit. You would turn this into an actual hotel, like a boutique hotel. Both of them. Yeah. At like the very least, museums. Two. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Exactly. Like Thai too, right? It's not a museum, a hotel, or a hotel. It's not a museum. You know. We're making money. Look at this. I bet that was his uh, statue. Huh? I think you're right. Wouldn't okay, you want to look at that from your? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. See, yeah, so they closed it off just like they did the other place. So you don't see many of the Look at these doors. Oh my gosh. Look at these. It really can be. Nah. It's going in the top people's pockets. Lunch. Okay. Yeah.